take a left side, you take a right, and then Smith will take could get behind me. All right, two set. All right. Three set. All right, run them up. Breaks away. And VR, that shit looks ridiculously good, man. <laughs> I bet. Got to stay below 4,000. Roger. I've got my radar all. I'm gonna start to initiate a left turn as soon as I get it. Start going towards the first waypoint. Saddled with three. This can't be real in front of us. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> you spoiled the uh, F-16 boys. We got a lot of fuel, so I'm gonna just stay low and fast, anyways. Where are you guys at? I'm right to your right, low. Oh, I've got visual. Hit sequence on your waypoint, and then auto, and then I'll. Give you a nice little line Watch between the all the waypoints. Yeah, be careful of those power lines. Yeah, this looks awesome in VR. Whatever the timing is, it's fucking. <laughs> it's golden hour. Awesome, we're gonna be flying through that valley. What's your speed? Four sixteen. I'm gonna throw it back a little bit to about ninety five percent. The Mark 83s have a pretty, pretty big uh, frag range, so we might have to do like a brake maneuver as soon as you drop them and kind of get away from the blast radius. And maybe pop up before we reach the target. That's what I'm thinking. Whatever you think, man. Yep, fencing also. 13.9. One fence in, 16 one. I'm looking for the fuel gauge, looking for the fuel gauge. Bottom left. <laughs> ah, it's oh. been a while, huh? Holy shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, 16 2. <laughs> wow, it's been a while with the Hornet. Oh, yeah, it's been well, months, man. 
come the 15th, it's going to be an everyday occurrence, so. Fuck yeah, dude. I'm so hyped for the carrier. No enemies on the SA page. I guess they're going to scramble as soon as we start striking our precious Hornet factory. I tell you, that, uh, that, that super carrier can't come at a better time. Everyone's going to be, like, quarantined. <laughs> yeah, when they finally decide to shut down America. <laughs> Ridiculous, but whatever. Yeah, a little overblown, but whatever. The economy's going to get hit hard, dude. Yeah, man, I'm not looking forward to it. It's going to be a nope. bad couple months or years. A lot of businesses are going to close over this shit. Yeah, it's not looking good. I don't have visual on you, but I'm right behind you somewhere. I've got you guys on daylight. You're probably a couple miles behind. Yep. Let me go throw it back a bit. Because I don't want to get there before you guys and then it triggers the uh, enemy fighters. I'm just reaching the end of waypoint one, about four miles away from it. Yeah, I'm about three miles ahead of you. Yes, last night I was about three miles ahead of you too. What the fuck, bro? Or behind, you mean? Or? That's what I meant. Yeah, oh, okay, okay. Just make sure. I see on my data link anyways. Yep. Well, I don't know how to freaking set my uh, programs in here, so I'm just going to go to bypass it. <laughs> I, I've, I never set programs for flares. I always just do bypass. I have a Lua file that I pop in. I can give it to you when we get out of here if you... Turn it on, set manual one, and you have your program. Nice. It's only two programs, though, but whatever. Yeah, but at least with the uh, F-18, you can you actually have a manual flare and a manual shaft. You don't have to set the program. It gives you some. Oh shit! Yeah, Ooh, it's true. Right over those power lines, that was close. It is true. The 16 doesn't have that exchange. It'd be nice when we get uh, automatic programming. A little, I mean, semi or automatic, either one of them. Some, yeah, yeah, you're right. I mean, so far the uh, the CMDS programs are working out pretty for me, pretty. Yeah, me too. You know, it's funny. Um, I feel that I can, like, I feel like in the 16, I can do more damage at this target than I can in this. Get those clusters. Yeah. I don't know. That's just the way I feel. I, I feel more comfortable hitting things. I mean, even when, even if you, we didn't have the CB 97s, I would still feel more comfortable. In the 16, yeah. Switch, I think. Switch, switch all in the avionics seem more intuitive to me. Uh, me too, 100%, not even close. Like the Hornet kind of does things. I don't know, it's a little weird. I understand them, but I prefer the uh, 16. So, one thing I don't like about either one of them is the automatic MFD change there every time you switch the mode. And like turning on the radar on the 16, because in the, the F-18, I like my radar on the left, TGP on the right. I like my uh, like the center map. I don't even use that because I have to look so far freaking down, and so I I'd rather just keep that like stores or any kind of like miscellaneous systems. Right. But I just wish I had more control. The A-10 I love because you can program like that your MFDs, you know, all of your parts can. But for some reason, the F-16 and the 18, everything's automatic and drives me nuts. Well, the F-16 is a lot more uh, customizable than the 18. True. Like, I keep my radar on my right, and I also use my TGP on my right, and I keep the SA page in the middle and the bottom. It's not something I stare at all the time. It's something I take peeks at. And then the left is... The left changes all the time. Every time I take a different weapon, it changes somehow. Yeah, well, my, on my left, I always, that's the one I switch out the most. The right, I kind of keep the, the same settings. 
So my, yeah. my, my fighting MFDs are essentially the, the left and right one. My center is only for like reference, because I don't like looking that far down. Yeah. Like I but said, that's my, that's my SA. I just take peaks. Right. Yeah. Super useful. At 16, I just pop fucking sensor select right, and I switch through whatever MFD I want. HSD is so easy. That's one thing that's nice about the A10, the F16, is that you don't have to take your hands off the HOTAS to switch your MFD. Yeah, dude, it's awesome. I guess I just have to get used to the Viper a little bit more. To me, using using the HOTAS to switch MFD is still a little foreign to me. All you gotta do is hit DMS right to select the right one, DMS left <laughs> to select the last one. It's the right. simplest thing. And then you press DMS down to make one or the other soy. It's, it's fucking awesome. The Hornet's cool, though. I mean, I definitely like it. I just feel like when both are fleshed out, I feel like the uh, F-16's got an edge on it. Interesting. What's up? No, no, I'm just saying. I mean, weapon-wise, it definitely has the edge on it, I think. 87s, 97s, 103s, and 105s are big right Marley, there. Bro. Yeah, yeah. Just those four. So the... the the 87 and the 97, the, the 103 and 105 are the guided version of those, so. It's dirty, bro. A, a guided cluster bomb? It's dirty. Yeah, it's fucking. It's gonna do a lot of damage. Yeah, but the, the bad thing about the 105 and 103 is that you have to manually plug in the wind. It does not map the music. Right. Which just sucks. You're right about that. I didn't know that until that new A10. I was flipping through the Chuck's updated A10, and I had no idea that you had to manually plug it in because I, I I was never impressed with the 105 or 103 because it never landed where I wanted it to be. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. I just used the 97, 87 to uh, counteract the wind manually by dropping different locations, and then I was like, well, I'm just. <laughs> Hornet's cool though. I like it. I just love. Uh... You know, boot ops, CV ops, so. Yeah. I've never been a, a huge fan of Air Force airframes. I mean, they're still badass, but. Me neither. I've always, I've always been into the carrier aviation shit. I like that 14s, A6s, and um, Hornets, Vipers. I mean, they're all cool, but. Yeah, they're all fucking cool in their own way. Turning the waypoint three. Yep, four points, four miles behind. Roger. I guess where should we point is the attack one? Oh, okay. Uh, after we, after, after we uh, finish we the waypoint three leg, that's we should, when uh, we go on the target. Yeah, we should tighten this up also. Yeah, I'm going to slow down. Let what's you guys catch what's up. your speed now? I'm, I'm passing below 400 right now. Alright, going 440. Gotcha. I'm going over that little mountain right now. Yep, coming there. We're right behind. And I'm right behind you, like. Yep. Thirteen miles away, point three. The Eurofighter should be interesting. Oh yeah, for sure. Not a big Eurofighter guy, but pretty cool. Still uh some new to the to the sim. Always gotta appreciate it. A six would have been Unless amazing, it's a fucking but... Christian Eagle. Like why the fuck did they add that shit to DCS? Yeah, no, Ace A six would have been amazing. <laughs> yeah, I really want an A six. The A seven is gonna be awesome whenever that comes out. Agree. I would rather get the A seven than the Eurofighter. Well they're both coming, so yeah, if, exactly. if it was between a Eurofighter and an A6, it's the A6 easily. Yeah, 
your fighter's cool, but A6 is just is a fucking intruder, man. He, come on. Like, Imagine being co-op, dude. Like multi-crew. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my. I'm going about 280 right now, 289. I'm going to start speeding back up. Yep, going 427. How far are you from waypoint 3? 7.2. Still two miles behind. Roger. Okay. I'll stick around 320. Yeah, multi-crew in a fucking A6 would be fucking amazing, dude. Hell yeah, dude. Especially with the way the brat, like the uh, canopy things are. It looks <laughs> like eyes. Dude, it's so sick. That's such a cool plane, man. I didn't appreciate that plane until I got in the middle. <laughs> When you first get to the Navy, you're like, ah, it's a piece of shit. And then you start watching it every day, you're like, that's a bad motherfucker. All right, so just double check me. Uh, if I want to drop it in pairs, so I got four bombs. So I want go to your, quantity two, multi two, right? Uh, quantity two, multi two, one. Because if you do multi twos of two, it'll drop four bombs. Okay, that's what I was wondering. Yep. Oh, then, I, okay, I just leave interval to zero dropped at the same time, I got you. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay, 1.3 miles from waypoint 3. Still going about 315. 1.6, so we're right behind you. Okay, I'm going to start speeding up again. We're going to turn to waypoint 4. Well, this is our waypoint to the target, so... Yep, it is. Get your, get your war face on. All right. 28 miles. All right, I'll, I'll stick to the left side of the valley. You guys could take your positions to where we're striking. All right, I'm taking the center. Right Copy. Up. To the right. Just keep in mind, keep the, you're probably going to have to keep it above 1,000 AGL because right now I'm at 1,000 AGL and I'm intermittently hitting the uh, the pull up warning so we don't frag ourselves with a bomb. Yeah, I'm already yeah. past that. Yep. We're, we're going to have to pop up. Oh, I see. Somebody at least 3K. Somebody just passed me on the left. Yeah, I think that was me. Okay, cool. We'll use a little um, another thing we're gonna have to do is um, which way are we turning for the second strike? Uh, let's 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 do uh, Alfredson. Since you get the north, you make a right turn. Yeah. Um, Muji, you make a left turn, and I'll mm -hmm. do a right turn right behind you, Alfredson. And then following our second pass, uh, we'll all be making a left pull off. It looks like about thirteen hundred. You're out of your frag thing, so you good. I've got you on my right. I've got you on my other right. Okay, cool. I don't even have visual on you guys, man. Look left. There you are. Okay. I'm sliding to the right more. Roger. All right, I got visual on both of you. Eighteen miles. I think I've got visual on target. Seem I see like a black building. Yep, tally. Popping up out. a little bit. We'll go about 1300. Is it this little town right in front of us? Yep, eight miles away. Yeah, I really can't see the target. It's too great, but. Uh, I think I see him. It doesn't look like the briefing page. Nope, <laughs> that's for sure. Is it that factory building? Is that what it is? Yeah. The enemy knows where you are. Right. Five minutes on target until the enemy fighters arrive. Okay. 
and the AAA is marked. Copy. Alright. I'm going for the factory all the way on the left. The one on the right. Okay, now I see it's like the briefing. Okay. Popping up. Alright, running in. Popping up. Alright, mud triple A straight ahead. Pickle two. Alright, good hit. I suck, mine was a miss. Got one bomb left, actually. I'm gonna come back around. Yeah, yeah same. Time. What's that? I'm gonna uh, since we got a bit, I'm gonna go uh, one shot. Right, right, climb and pull off. I'm gonna drop one, and then I'm gonna come around for another one. You know, I missed my first off. Roger. All right, good hit on my target. Pickle. Okay, good hit on my second target. That's three targets. Alright. I'm hit, I'm hit, I'm hit. Oh, fuck. Alright, I'm leaking fuel. Alright, which target are you taking, Mike? The big factory? Alright. Uh, big I'm factory. Having, I'm having some trouble controlling right now. I'm not sure exactly what's damaged. I'm gonna start flying towards the carrier. Yeah, copy. Yeah, I'm gonna bug out of here. I'm not sure what he damaged. Mine's a hit. My second one. I'm going okay. for another one. Uh, I see. They took out my. Uh, they took out one of my. Uh, my uh, horizontal right. stabs. All right. Switching to single. I'm gonna hit the last two targets with my uh, last two bombs. Right. Copy. Going up for my last right now. I don't want to bug out. I'm gonna shoot out left to the. All right. I'm gonna take the target that's closest to that uh, burning hulk. So you take the far right one, or the far northern one. Apparently, I didn't uh, change them. I thought I did. All right. I'm Fucking triple A, man. Alright, I got uh, nails F 14 to the north. Yeah, copy. We could head to the south, get the fuck out if you want. Yeah. Right, F 18. Cab, from, cab took off from the carrier to about 50 miles away. Okay, turning so back just, in now from the last bomb. Yeah. Yeah, copy, covering you. Yeah, I'm bugging out. Can't go too quick, though. My shit's pretty, a little fucked up. Pretty cool mission, man. Yeah. Colt 1, airborne. Alright, Alright, first. Alright, good hit. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, oh that's sweet, nice. dude. That's sweet. Alright, let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, I'm getting the fuck out. About 50 miles from the carrier. What's your uh, steering? Go about uh, 225. We got a guy about 30 miles behind us. Let's go. Alright, 225. Heading 225. 225. We burning? Yeah, hit the gates. I've still got plenty of fuel, so... Yeah, looks like we got two F-18s behind us. Uh, two F-18s 14. got 14. sent up. Yeah, we got two F-18s coming from the Stennis. We should hop out. I'm right to your left. I see you over there. I'm gonna jump down into this valley right here. You got me? Yep. yep, turning towards you now. About 35 Visual. miles from Stennis. Alright, saddle with you, Mike. Copy. Fuck, man, this thing is hard to control. That was fun. Might not even be over yet, we don't even know. <laughs> I'm gonna go for a straight on the carrier. I don't think I could do a, a case one with this damage. Alright, tanks are gone. I'm down in internal fuel. Fuck yeah. Uh, does anybody have the carrier BRC? Nope. 39 miles. Roger. Let me go check real quick.
BRC Fine. is 180. I find out when I get there, I don't even care. <laughs> well, it's 180 if you want to put it into your, uh, your course. That's pretty fun. Yeah, not bad. I like to blind, five minutes of terror. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it should be. Right. That's cool, the cat aircraft are about to fly right over us. It's pretty sick. I just made it back to the carrier. Did you take any fire bike? I didn't get hit. There. I went over to AAA on my second pass and it took out my Dude, my look above us. Look at the above us. Look at the alert fives. You see them? That's yeah. awesome. Oh, fuck, man. This thing is hard. Raven 1's gonna be fun, man. Can't wait, dude. I gotta finish a couple of them. A couple more of those things tonight. Or tomorrow. And then I gotta do more for Harry and Mission that he has. The Gooch wants in on this. Oh, yeah, the voice oh. acting? <laughs> yeah. The Gooch oh, wants yeah, in, bro. Oh, dude, I might have to ditch this aircraft. I don't know if I can control that low speed. Getting locked up by F4. They got him. Colt 1-1's got him. You should see how unstable this shit is right now. Yeah, visual. Ah, does not want to fly slow. Colt 1, descending bandit at Bulls 2, 5, 8, for 9. Cruisers are sending up SAMs, dude. Yeah, I was going to say, I got the gas, I could, I could go help out if I wasn't worried about them getting shot down. Yeah. Fuck, man. Uh, I got ditched. Oh, fuck, man. Yeah, I lost Oh, that's it. you right there. Yeah, I saw you. Yeah, I, I couldn't control it anymore. Alright, I'm gonna throttle back because these, just in case these guys uh, penetrate the sand bear. Yep. I'm doing the same. Alright, turning back to the north. Alright, well. Actually, I'm gonna land. I ripped through all my fucking fuel. Well, I guess uh, I technically survived by ejecting, but eh. rest in peace. Peace.